Hi friends, today we have a new question that if I give you a word as input, you need to find all the possible word combinations using the letters of the word, right? So in this example, if I give you extreme as input, so these highlighted letters, if I use these four, I can have another word which is tree. So you need to have all these possible derived words from this word, right? So I use a variable named as inp, INP and I put the input word here. Let's say extreme is the word and I need to find all the possible words using this word. So first of all, I need to break this word into letters. So for that, I use letter again a variable equals. I'll form a list and this list would be formed using x for x in this input, right? So this way I can get all the letters of the word in the list format. Right, so we have seen one thing here that we have printed all the letters, but the first letter was E capital, so therefore it took that also in capital here. But see, when we will be forming different words, this E may come in between and will result in giving a capital in between, right? When we'll print that word, right? So better that we convert all the letters in same case. So for that, we use x dot lower instead of direct x right so this way we'll be converting all the elements into lowercase now we need to form all the possible permutations so for that we'll be using the library iter tools so for from iter tools import permutations now after that we need to get all the permutations so we use permutations letter and this way we can get all the per possible permutations but permutation give us a permutation object which we can convert into list format using list function so we give it into list and then we can print on console so this way we'll be able to print all the possible permutations using all these letters right so we can expand it to see where we have all the possible permutations Right. This is uh, not easy to read because we have taken a big word uh, in it as input. So we can take a smaller word to see it uh, for the testing and then later we can try out other words. Right. So I use the word then and these are the combinations, not combinations but permutations possible using these letters. Now let's say we have all these permutations as list format. Let's say we need the words using these letters so i iterate through all these permutations one by one and then i join it using join function so blank string dot join and pass on the list it will join and give you the word so these are the possible words that we can derive using these possible permutations now we have seen that there are certain words which have not any dictionary meaning so now to validate whether that is a dictionary word or not we use another library which is enchant so import enchant now after importing it we need to set the dictionary here we can set that we want to use english dictionary so for that we will be using here d equals enchant dot dict and here we need to pass on the parameter which is the locale part so en underscore us is for us english language right so that means we are referring to us english dictionary and whenever we need to validate whether that word is a dictionary word or not we can simply use the function d dot check and we can give the word it will return true if that word is a dictionary word it will return false if that is not a dictionary word we also put another check here that if length of the word that is formed is greater than um, two only then give us the result otherwise no right so we don't want one letter or two letter words for example so for that we can easily put a condition here that if length is greater than two then only go into the checking part and then print it so now let's do one more thing here change the word from then to extreme to find out all the possible permutations using extreme word we are left with one more change here so here we are using the permutations function we let's say pass on second argument as four to get all the possible permutations using four letters right so this way we'll get all the words which are possible using four letters of uh, these elements that we get 
Now since we need only the unique words here, so we create a set op equals set and we add all the words to this set op dot add z as input. Now we need to get all the words so that means these words may be three letter word, four letter word, five letter word or whatever but we are skipping for one and two letter words so for that we need to have another loop here above it and we need to pass this as a variable so for n in range length of input so this way we can move from zero to length of input otherwise if we do not want to have this condition here you can directly say that we want to start from two to length right or maybe three to length yes so this way we'll be omitting all the possible permutations using two letter or one letter word now we run it and this way we get all the possible permutations which are either three letter four letter five letter and so on and so forth right so that is all this way we can have all the dictionary words if you have any question in this particular example feel free to write to me in the comment section and if you have any other better approach do share with us I would love to recommend your solution to others also if that is more useful. Thank you for being with us. See you later.